Now moving to the risk management strategy category and the first subcategory control ID RM1. Risk management processes are established, managed, and agreed to by organizational stakeholders. Now, the previous ca uh, category was uh, risk management assessment. So obviously doing an assessment is one thing that should inform how you're going to create and craft your strategy, but you still need to develop, articulate, and document some type of strategy. So is there a comprehensive strategy to manage the risk of the organizational operations, its assets, its individuals, other organizations that you're working with? Uh, is the risk management strategy implemented consistently across the organization, or is it very ad hoc? Do you just have maybe one area that has uh, a strategy, and maybe it's not just encompassing of the rest? I don't know. Something to be looking at. Uh, are the individuals who are associated with this, are they designated to fulfill specific roles and responsibilities within the organization risk management process? You have to have people identified to be able to fulfill any type of strategy. It can't just exist on paper, something that you just go point to once or twice a year when the auditors come around, it's something you need to follow, you need to live by, you need to really own. Um, and are the procedures developed and managed and distributed to the organizational members? Do people even know the strategy exists? It's one thing to have it, it's one thing to have people that you uh, have to support it, but you actually have to make people aware that it exists. What is it doing for them? What are other people's roles? Do they know where they need to be involved? Again, part of risk management as a whole is obviously assessing what you have as a risk, but then also moving into developing a plan to consistently address that risk on an ongoing basis. This is not point in time security. That those are the nineties. This day, those days are over. In fact, it probably shouldn't even happen back then. You need to be able to develop something that you can abide by, control, manage, and shepherd along during the evolution and maturity of your organization and your security program. So starting with this subcategory control, IDRM1, risk management processes are established, managed, and agreed to by organizational stakeholders. Take a look, rewrite it if you have to, socialize it because you need to, and then we'll come back for the next one. Thanks.